terms of the different parts of the instrument and the, the names of the parts. Uh, so is there, are, are there any special names that go along with it? I mean, what, what type of wood are you using? What type of a body is it? The animal hide? Yeah. Uh, are there any specific... Uh, yeah, we, the hide, we don't have a specific hide telling us. But normally this one, the wood, uh, the cultural one is called patat. 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 Wow. Patat. 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 All right, so the, the, the cultural wood yeah, that we yeah. used. So what you're using now looks more no, like a no, broomstick no, or... Yeah, uh, I don't have the original one. It's now okay. it is very... To get it here, no, no, it's very difficult to have. Okay. And the body that you're using, is that a calabash? Yeah, this is a calabash. With a good, good skin. With goat skin. And... Uh, I see that you you have fishing line yeah. as the strings, but yeah. is there also a cultural uh, yeah, string? Yes, yeah. <laughs> this one Kabul. 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 So the strings were originally called Kabul. Kabul, yeah. And were they uh, a plant fiber? Were they horse uh, part of an animal, the sinew, or like what? What? So it's called Kabul. Yeah, Kabul. But what is that made of? Made of. Uh, Kabul, what is Kabul? What is Kabul? They told me before, mm -hmm. they were, uh, the original ones they're using, it out, they make it out of uh, a palm tree. Mm -hmm. Out of the palm? Uh, a, a palm tree. Okay, so it's plant, yeah, plant fiber. Yeah, the, the roots of it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the original one, before they... And, uh, and so they've this also... One call it's, this is Ubus. Ubus. Yeah. Ubus. 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 Now I see on, on your bridge you have multiple grooves cut in. Uh, three, yeah. So you have, one, I, I see it's five, only, but you no, only use three. No, it's only three. It's okay. not five. Because certain people are there just, they like maybe to in adjust their hand, they, they just adjust it here. Okay. They play it, you know. So start. it depending because on... It depends on me, on my fingers, that's why. All right, so... I don't so want the them to be close because it disturbs my fingers. Okay, so yeah. so that the cuts, uh, yeah. the additional grooves... Right, three. right, three. It's but three. but three. you have the choice of adjusting three. it based on your yeah. playing mm -hmm. desire. Is that something you made up or something you've seen before? This? No, it's just what I see. Yeah, okay. Yeah. So it's set to taste. Yeah. But okay. you have uh, other manjagos, they play, they play the tulu, but it's only two strings. Only two strings? Yeah, they play with only two strings. That's the, the man I'm telling you, that man, uh, uh, Noran. He play with two strings. Noran, okay. Yeah, Noran. Mm. Wow. They play with two strings, because they are different manjagos. <laughs> yeah, I've, yeah. I've, I've never heard of that with the Benchindu playing mm. only two strings. Yeah, people play with two yeah. strings, yeah, of course. When they have the two strings, which two strings? Uh, do they still tie it up like the two long strings? Yeah, yeah. They have to tie it up like this, but they only play two. All right, so of these three strings, which yeah. are the two? The two. I think they play this only two, these two. The two long ones? The two ones. Long ones. Not, the, not the short, no, high-pitched no, ones? they have to condemn one. You always know where condemn one. They play two only. Two strings. Hmm. Okay. They play only two. And in terms of of the playing technique, mm -hmm. um, how can you describe or could you demonstrate the how the the, the strings are played? Mm -hmm. Can you show us how that works, please? Yeah, the strings, yeah. Because normally when I'm mm -hmm. you have to try to, to see how it's tuned. Okay. How, yeah, so how, how is it tuned? What what are you listening for with the tuning? Tune, because me. Because the songs you are writing, you have to know the tune of the, the strings before it plays. Because if, when it doesn't have the tune, the, the songs you want to play, you cannot have the tune to play the, the songs. In the Is there more than one way to tune? A yeah, yeah, yeah. There are many tunes? People, people playing different. Yeah. Are there... Are there, you know, ten, ten different types of tuning, or two no, or no, three? I think maybe it's only two or three, like that. Two or three. Maybe it's back from two. Because maybe I, I have told you three, because the other people playing with uh, the two strings. That's why I have told you three, maybe it's only two people, you know. 
because you have different people because the way you, somebody play with you, the way you play is different mm -hmm. so you just try to have to own tuning to play the songs you want to play okay um, so in terms of the the pitches that you're going to hear what what do you listen for I mean so the way this is tuned right now is this a standard tuning for you yes On your left hand, um, it looks like you're stopping. Are you stopping both strings with one finger? Yeah. Uh, Do you ever stop it in any other position than this position? No, it's only from here to here. You only have to check where you have the, uh -huh. the, 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 the tune of your sound. Right. You're playing. You have to press your hand there. Uh -huh. Yeah. Um, once you find the position that's right for that tuning mm -hmm. um, and that moment, while you're playing, see if I can do two things at once, probably not. While you're playing, do you ever then slide your finger up? No, no, no. Don't slide up. No, it's, it's just, just where it is. Yeah. Where it is. To tie it, leave it. Yeah. It depends on the song you're playing. Just on so okay. you've got your three open strings, and then when you put your finger down, you've yeah. got two additional, yeah, like so there's five, five notes. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. That's Finishing up. Mm -hmm. This one, the top one is just the finishing note. Mm -hmm. Okay, so okay. <laughs> so it might be like tonic or it's something. In Manjago we call it kalinti. 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 Kalinti is the top, the, the pitch of the top string. Yeah. Kalinti. Kalinti. Now is that the name of the string or the name of the sound? Kalinti. Just it is a bagin string. Okay. Yeah, it's just a bagging string. It's the finishing string. It's the bagging, finishing string. bagging string of the song. Just call it Kalinti. And what about the other two strings? Are there names that go along with that? No, those two. I have I've got the only the only what I know is right here is only this one. Okay. Yeah. Well, would you mind performing another another song for us? Yeah, what and can you tell us what the name of the song is as well, please? Okay, let me or one of your favorite pieces to play. <laughs> Sounds different from me. Sometimes I just gotta just play entertaining. Uh, okay, I just have to play. Ogunda Karangangang. It's on the Ogunda Karangangang. It's a song which you play for. Ogunda Karangangang. It's songs play for somebody who has many cows. Okay. Yeah. And the name of that again, please? Ok Nda Karanganga. Ok? Ok. Ok Nda Karanganga. Okay. Oh, 